What's up, party animals? My name is Kezi, and I went to Anthro Northwest last weekend. It freaking slapped, dude. So, okay, last con, BLFC, absolutely amazing event, loved every second of it. Anthro Northwest was even better. I got over my little, like, oh, I'm so sad, I'm so scared, all the furries are gonna judge me. And Anthro Northwest, I went hard. So I had roommates this time, and uh, so the first thing I can remember is my roommate barking. And uh, I love that. I've always wanted to just be kind of more animal, more yippy yappy coyote wah wah wah, and he kind of helped me uh, feel comfortable barking at people. And it's kind of uh, embarrassing to do in front of camera, but uh, I'll give you one just for you. Okay, so I have now confidence to do that, which is pretty sick. Uh, doing it at like a con, you know, someone walks by and they're like, oh my god, it's you, and I'm like, it's the best. Straight up awesome. So, that was really cool. I feel more confident being a furry now after like rooming with like other fursuiters, other furries, and it was just mm, good stuff. And after that, I'm now walking around con space in my fursuit. People recognize me. People actually like saw me and was just like, oh my god, you're Kezi. And I'm like, I have no idea who you are, but the fact that you know who I am means that you're already my best friend. So what? It was so cool. It was super freaking cool. I loved, I, uh, I loved it. So the con itself, super fun, and met a ton of people, hung out with a ton of people, just absolutely vibed so hard. I loved every minute of it, but it got even better. There was something called Andy's Wonderland, or Adventureland. I can't remember. It was full of inflatables. thing and for I love just oh it was such a vibe where else can you sit on a giant inflatable dog listening to dubstep on a big loudspeaker nowhere except furry cons so hands down or paws down best experience oh my god I spent so much time in that room because it and the rave happened at the same time and they were right next door to each other so just vibing in there was so therapeutic almost. You know, I could just relax. I didn't have to worry about anything. My only goal was just to enjoy the moment. And it was, oh, it was so fun. I miss it so much. I want to go back onto the bounce house. I want to go, uh, I want to go back to Antoine Northwest. It was probably, it was probably even better than BLFC just because of that. Heck, they even had a ball pit that was in like some corner of some room. It was really funny because it looked like Dashcon, but it was adorable. Oh my God. I took like a ton of pictures with a ton of people inside the ball pit. It was cute as heck. Uh, and then even on another floor, they had like a little, uh, Cardboard fort. It was so fun. Oh my gosh. Such a such a vibe. Absolutely so much fun. Um, so much to do there. And I thought that was that was just awesome. So Anthro Northwest, pause down, good con. Highly recommend. Definitely going next year. Music. Uh, so I actually stayed with a friend for a week prior to Anthro Northwest, and I brought this beauty, my Polyend Tracker. And it was really smart. So BLSC, I brought the force, didn't use it once. Anthro Northwest, I brought the tracker, used it constantly. And I loved it. Um, one thing I did was I took a video of someone playing guitar and I sampled it into the tracker. So let's give that a listen because it is, it is so cool.
So that was probably one of the coolest things I did was get to sample a couple people. Um, I even like was up at like four o'clock in the morning in the main floor and I watched someone playing piano and managed to sample that too. The song's less good, but I love that idea of just kind of sampling the environment around you and kind of doing these collabs with anyone and everyone. I, I, I'm always following my ears during these, these events. Anytime I'm out and about, always following my ears because wherever there's music, there is something cool happening. And, oh, very good stuff to do. I, I just, music is my favorite thing in the world and being able to find it at the furry cons has been such a magical time as well. I just, oh, it was so much fun. So, got a ton done on the tracker. Um, probably for future cons, I'll be bringing the tracker some more. I might bring the force for one con if I can plan for it correctly, but pause down, tracker slaps. One of the craziest things to happen at Anthro Northwest was the fursuit walk. Not parade, this is actually an unofficial event hosted by none other than Zarafa the Giraffe. I might have butchered that name, but he's super freaking awesome. I've seen him at like every con, such a sweetheart, and knows how to put together a freaking vibe. So the whole thing was super cool. We walk, so we're, the hotel is close to something called Pike's Place Market. And it's this, this like kind of public bazaar where every, you can, you know, uh, uh, farmer's market, bars, everything, and since it was Sunday, there was a ton of people enjoying the nice weather, and it was kind of cold outside, so it was perfect for fursuiters. Oh my god, it was amazing. I loved uh, being on that walk. We had, like, a ton of furries with us. I don't even remember how many we had. There was no real head count, but just tons. And, oh, it was so fun! Um, here's a video of us kind of like chilling out next to, again, more music. Uh, this guy was just performing and all of a sudden a bunch of animals walk up to him and he's just like, oh my god, you guys are amazing, let's jam, heck yeah. Oh, it was just, it was such a wholesome experience. I love the connection of the community, of the fandom, and the community of like the local area. Everyone loved it, got tons and tons of pictures, got tons and tons of video. Um, people are even finding like videos and stuff like that on like Instagram of just people who live in Seattle and were like, oh, there's a bunch of dogs there. That's cool. And uh, it was so fun. I, I loved the fursuit walk and like, I cried so much during this. Being just out there with everyone, being part of something bigger than myself. I walked around and no one can see you cry in fursuit, so I just, oh, I was getting so misty-eyed so much because of just how, how awesome it is to be part of this. How awesome it is to just be able to do this, to live in a world where this can happen, to live in a, to be part of a community where not just you, but so many others can do that and just have fun. Oh, it was so magical. I loved it. I just, I can't get over how cool it was. I, Anthro Northwest slapped so hard. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Um, my roommates were saints. All the people I've met are awesome. Uh, if you've met me, go ahead and leave a comment. If you just have fun, like, just seriously, I loved meeting you all. Um, and I can't wait to do more. Uh, so, channel, channel updates. Uh, I got a new job. Actually, I got a new job and then I got another new job. I'm exhausted. I have been procrastinating this video for hours and hours and hours, and I just don't think I have it in me to do as much as I've been doing uh, lately. So there might be a drop in the quality of my content, there might be a drop in the upload frequency, there's probably gonna be a drop in me actually going out and doing things. I don't think I'm gonna be going to any events until maybe, big asterisk here, further confusion. I really wanna go, but who knows? <laughs> Uh, but, you know, I need to take a break, I need to save money, I am poor as heck, so, uh, donate to my Patreon if you want to help with that, but right now I'm just chilling, trying to save money, and see where my next steps take me. Um, super excited for this next chapter in my life, I am possibly moving even, so this room <sighs> might be different someday, and... I'm a little scared 
but uh, I just wanted to give you guys an update to say, hey, um, it's going to be a little bit slower. Uh, I'm going to be kind of a little bit of pulled back a little bit. I want to keep making music. That's something that I enjoy doing. So if you want to keep up with my shenanigans, uh, go ahead and follow me on my socials and check out my SoundCloud because I upload tons of stuff to those. Uh, and I guess that's it. So I appreciate all of you. Um, leave a comment with what you enjoy about furry cons or what you hope to see at one. And until next time, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.